everyone welcome back to my channel so this is my second video back here on YouTube I'm so excited this is just gonna be a great week of filming like it will be I know it so um, as I mentioned in my last video today's video is gonna be a get ready with me chit chat I will be explaining why I left YouTube my aspirations and goals with life and YouTube in general if I don't mention any of the products as I'm going along in this video click the description down below I'll have them all listed for you with links to where you can buy them I got you guys so without further ado let's just get right onto this video Okay guys, so I went and did my brows off camera. I have been such a perfectionist when it comes to my brows, so I take my time with them. This video alone would be like 20 minutes long just on my brows if I did my brows on camera. So anyways, enough with my sass. I will be doing a get ready with me. As I mentioned in the intro, today I will be looking at my mirror. It's quite a big, so... That's perfect. And um, I'm not really doing like a crazy look today. I'm not doing, I'm not going anywhere special today. Uh, just hanging out. Enough with my rambling though. I'm going to just go straight on to um, why I left YouTube. So I decided to take a break from YouTube because I was just very uninspired. I feel like a lot of YouTubers go through this. Um, it's just a thing that we all go through, I feel. It's not uncommon and I just was so unhappy with the content I was putting up for you guys. I just, I wasn't happy. So I'm gonna go in with my Tartis Pro Palette. I do want to mention quickly that if I don't mention any of the products that I'm using as I'm going along in this video, I will have them listed in my description with links to where you can get them. So don't you worry. So again, taking my Tartis Pro Palette and I'm going to be taking the shade Innocent. So as I was saying, I just was very uninspired, not motivated, and I just wasn't happy with the content I was putting out for you guys. I felt like with the camera quality that I had, I could have been doing way better. And I'm just like any YouTuber, a perfectionist, and you want things that you are putting out there to be good, you know? And if you know you have the power to make them good, why not do so? So I felt like towards like my last few videos, I was just really desperate to either a put out content of course but also you know making them look good i was like already at the last two videos really like just done you know at the end i didn't want to claim to quit i didn't want that because i knew i was going to come back it's just that uh i was just i just needed a break and in this break in the beginning i didn't even want to think about youtube at least for my channel I wanted to, you know, take a break. I didn't want to think about it at all. I was just, you know, carefully thinking about like my my life, you know, like focusing on myself and not YouTube and, you know, just other things in general. But like, going back with YouTube and all that stuff. So the first part of like me leaving, I uh I didn't care about it. Like I didn't want to think about it. And then the second half of it or the second part of you know me taking the break i missed it and i was like I'm, i don't want to go back to youtube unless i feel that i have the right equipment so that may sound like bougie to some people i don't know but uh i wanted to splurge a little bit of money to make myself happy to film you know content for you guys so that's what i did so here i took the shade whimsy right over here second to darkest shade and I'm just doing the same thing now with my shaper brush i'm taking the shade smoke so I, I missed it i wanted to invest on lighting and a green screen and all of this stuff that i felt could help me out by the way guys if you do want like a video on the lights that i got the green screen like basically a review the pricing where i got them from i would be so happy to do it for you guys because you know spoiler alert i love everything that i got i'm very very pleased with it all and i was on a budget so i know there are a lot of people who are on a budget as well that are seeking for lighting and all that stuff and i will be very happy to share my lighting with you guys so if you guys are like ogs to my channel then you would see hopefully a huge improvement in like my lighting and background obviously so I'll be very very pleased to do that for you guys so i invested in all that stuff it took me a while to actually think about what i wanted you know paycheck after paycheck from my job i was like 
debating do I really want to get this now or should I just film without you know the equipment that I think is necessary to get now should I just should I just go for it like who cares not splurge my money now a lot of people who aren't into my craft may think that yeah you know just continue as you have been don't splurge your money save your money which I I don't regret splurging my money because like I said I'm very happy with what I got so of course the advice that I'm telling you people have told me by not spending my money I didn't listen to I spent my money I got my stuff and I you know kind of prepared myself I like set everything up the way I would like it to be for videos and I you know erased all my images on Instagram if you guys are coming from there then hey so you guys know how my Instagram was before and it was just very sloppy and it was kind of like a personal account and I didn't want that I wanted you know when you first go into my makeup account then you know it's a makeup account I missed it you know towards the end last two weeks before coming back on I, I really missed it and I I didn't know how to come back on I didn't know what video I should film and you know how to come back on but now I feel like I'm coming out better I know with what I'm doing now in the long run it's gonna be all worth it so I'm patiently waiting for that so that is why I basically left and what are my aspirations for YouTube is you know to continue to always be consistent I do plan on uploading every Monday Wednesdays and Fridays and post on all social media platforms every single day so far I've been doing very well with that so I plan to stay consistent if you don't follow me on any social medias then they will be linked down below now aspirations for life in general along with YouTube be more into what I'm doing which is like my makeup and stuff I want to get more into it rather than just you know waiting for something else or like to start all over like I basically did with my YouTube so that's basically all of course this is not the end of the video since it is a get ready with me so I'm gonna complete my face and I will be explaining like what products I am using I'm gonna be taking my voluminous lash paradise mascara so now I'm taking my Marc Jacobs undercover coconut primer this smells so bomb you guys need to have this it smells so good you guys my coconut so now I'm taking my hourglass stick foundation I believe I'm in the shade golden and I always put too much of this, so don't put too much. Um, and I'm still, as I'm saying I put too much, I'm still putting too much. Now I'm taking my Tartiste Shape Tape Concealer. I recently just got a lot of new products. Well, new for me. So now I'm taking my contour brush. I love this brush so much. It came with my Pro Fusion Contour Kit. So like I said, today I'm not really going anywhere. I'm going to go out for some lunch. Lately, with my Instagram and my Twitter, like all basically all social media platforms, I have been trying to post more consecutively and, you know, get like a, a theme going on like a lot of people do on Instagram. So on my off days, which are the weekends, I like to go on for a photo shoot or just do like five to ten different makeup looks because, I don't know, like... I have obviously you know things to post of course but also it's like a little bit different you know like I said if you're coming from my Instagram from like way back then you know that my Instagram was not like popping like you probably didn't even know that I was a beauty guru my mom recently went to Las Vegas and she got me this mug it says party girl Las Vegas and I thought it was so cute inside it has zebra print I'm obsessed with animal print as I mentioned in my last video with my 50 random facts you guys should totally watch that video because it's like more personal type of video than any video I've ever done here on YouTube so you should go check it out after this one of course so now I'm taking my Milani rose gold blush I literally went shopping for so many products that are new for me and blush just wasn't one of them so I really love my Milani blush it's really running out I hit pan already um but I don't know guys I I love it too much I have to get a new one so I don't want to consider this like my everyday makeup routine because it's not it's just like a random look that I could see myself wearing on a day-to-day -day basis um, when I don't have time mascara and this is what I like to do. So this is a Stila liquid eyeshadow. I'm obsessed with these. I don't use it as my 
lid look i use it more for like an inner corner look which is great so that's what i'm gonna do now i'm taking my eco tools brush and taking the shade vintage and just highlighting my brow bone so now lips i'm taking my blistex chapstick uh, my sexy mother pucker from sloping glory and uh a random lip gloss from victoria's secret so this is like my favorite 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 combo for my lips as of lately like so that is the final look for this get ready with me chit chat video i really hope you guys enjoyed this video this is my second video back and i'm really really excited i really really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did please like this video subscribe to my channel and click that notification and down right next to the subscribe button so you don't miss my next video i upload every monday wednesday and friday that is my new schedule stick with it don't miss a video all beauty related things also linked right here are my videos so you guys can check them out if you've ever missed a video i really hope you guys have a wonderful day and please, please, please be you. Don't be anybody else. Everyone else is taken. You are beautiful and have a lovely day.